In this lesson, we're going to be looking at writing these numbers in their exact values, okay? Now, the key thing, this number is written, the first number here, 4 times 10 to the 4th, is written in standard form. Now, when a number is written like this, the number at the bottom, for example, the 10, is is called the base and the number up top here, the 4, is called the power. Now, what the power does, it tells you how many times the base is multiplying itself. So, in writing the exact value for this number, this would be equal to, I would put my 4 times, and if you notice, 10 is multiplying itself 4 times, okay? So, that would be 4 times 10 times 10 times 10 okay and if you notice I have four tens there one two three four and this suggests that this is four to the four to the ten sorry ten to the fourth power okay now really what this is this is four times and I can multiply my tens to say ten tens is a hundred okay a hundred times ten is a thousand and a thousand times ten is ten thousand so really this is four times ten thousand and in its exact value I could say four times ten thousand would give me forty thousand one two three okay so four times ten to the fourth in as in its exact value would work out to be 40,000. Good, let's move on to exercise two. Now in exercise two, we have six to the fourth. Again, the six here at the bottom is the base and the four up top here can be called the index or the power. And as I've said initially, that the four tells you how many times the base or six in this case is multiplying itself. So this is really six times six times six times six. If you notice how many times I have six multiplying itself, one, two, three, four times. So this is equal to six, six would give me 36 times Remember, I'm, I've just multiplied the first two set, sets of sixes. So here, the first two sets of sixes gives me 36. And I'm going to multiply my two last set of sixes. So I would have another 6 times 6 again would give me another 36. So this is equal to 36 is multiplying itself twice. And, and I mean, we can work this out uh, the long way. I could say 36 times 36, okay? And I could say this is 6 times 6 is 36. So I would place a 6 here. I would get 36. So I place a 6 there and carry my 3. Okay, so I would say 6 threes. 6 threes would give me 18. And 18 plus 3 would give me a 21. So I put my 21 here. Okay, now I am through using the 6 in the units column to multiply my 36. Now I need to move to use my 3 in my tens column. So I would have to put a placeholder right there. Okay, so I would now say 3 sixes again would give me 18. So I put down my 8. I put down my 8 there. Okay, and now I would carry my 1. And I'm saying 3 3 is 9 and 1 would give me 10. Okay, this is a bit hill and gully <laughs> so let me just straighten that out for you so really i'm adding and i'm adding six plus zero would give me a six eight plus one would give me a nine two plus let me pull down the screen a bit two plus zero that would give me a two here and i would bring down my one so 36 times 36 would work out to be one thousand 296 so for this I would have for my answer 1296 and it's it's as simple as that feel free if you are not clear on something you could always feel free to leave a comment or post your question all right bye bye